Hi everyone, uh, in this quick video I am going to demonstrate to you how you can spot a genuine uh, pair of diesels or if you are selling it on eBay uh, high-end items diesels now I have three pair of similar diesel, this diesel industry uh, look at this one's like a brownish label and the other one the same thing on a dark grey label and this one does not have any label but uh, the way to tell this is a genuine uh, diesel gin you see here on the back of the the belt uh, on top you will see a three um, stitched uh, stripes one's green one's white and one's red that refers to the Italian flag so any high-end jeans made in Italy will have that three the stitch mark right at the back of the jean. So to prove the point, this pair is called Yarrick. There we are. As you can see, inner they have a inside the label. They got that three again, three of these stitch, green, white, and red Italian. Black marks, okay. And if you can look at down here, you always find uh, the symbol, the skull symbol there with the with the Roman aureus. Yeah, you see clearly this is made in Italy there. And always look for that silver stripes there in the sticker. Look, so what can you see? A silver. Yes, stripes is always, and that will prove they're genuine. Yes, similar to the silver lining you get in the inside the pound notes or military fund. Okay, that's that. And the next thing, okay, to show you, okay, let's get this one, bring this one out. This one's Yarky, Larky, sorry, Larky. Yeah, again, if you look at this, the label here, let's get the label out, yeah, as you can see, yeah, there we go, the silver lining, silver stripes, yeah, the lining here, let's see, okay, and this one is made in, as you can see, this one's made in Tunisia, and the other one, get rid of the other one, again, this one's a little lurky, okay and here again the same thing silver silver stripes here but this one is made in morocco there we go right and another thing you have to bear in mind when you're buying these type of um jeans right and most of the time on the label you will say something like waist 30 length 32 but actually what um, when people buy it what they do they shorten it right so this one's been shortened look and the way to tell is shortened look if you look at the stitch on the genuine pair here if you can look at the stitching here right and then you come down and look at the stitch down here can you see the difference okay look at the stitching on here and look at the stitching over there right if they were genuine factory sh shortened or whatever you know you will have you will contain the same sort of thread okay but it's not so let's open it up and see so they've done a good job look they shorten it but this is done very professionally shortened okay right so that's how you tell if he's been shortened but this one is professionally shortened in the shop so it's done a very good job of it okay right and another one on this one right on the sorry Yarrick one on the Yarrick it says 30 waist 30 length 34 I'm sure it's been cut look as you go down to the hem yeah look at this color of the thread sort of golden brown okay you come down there 
and you can see look look at the way they're stitching on this one against stitching there and if you open it up and uh, there you go fruit of the pudding they have cut it look they have shortened somebody have shortened it look see there you go it's been shortened lovely so that's this is the way you can work it out you don't want to buy something it says 30 and 34 you take it home and you find out it just doesn't fit you as small or large you know so make sure you you look at it in that one okay I hope this video helped you a bit uh, whenever you go and buy this type of jeans from cardboard cell or any other establishment make sure you look at the label properly um, and make sure you get this uh, Roman Aurea Scalia yeah, and and the silver silver lining on the tags to know they're genuine so thank you so much for watching this video and all of my other videos I hope you like this one please uh, like subscribe and click button and comment comment so once again, thank you.